So while this question, what does a circle sound like, doesn't really make any sense, I'm thinking let's not only answer this for a circle, but what does a square sound like, or a star, or really any arbitrary curve, and here's how we're gonna do it. Let's parameterize our circle, or in other words make it so that a particle can cyclically travel along its path, and what I'm interested in is the height of this particle at any given moment, so that I can define our sound space as playing different pitches relative to this height. So here's a high frequency, and here is a low frequency. When we then break this down into what I'm calling the frequency graph, that's a trademark, we can actually listen to what a circle sounds like. And this is what a square sounds like. And here are a couple of other shapes. Some interesting things to note here is because I don't really have a way to turn a function into sound, what I'm actually doing is approximating our sound using a sequence of steps which I can generate pure tones for. And this gets closer and closer to the actual sound the more sub-steps that I add in. Another thing is that a shape and a rotated version of it give different frequency graphs, but what you'll notice is that rotating ends up being identical to just changing the phase of that graph. Anyways, there is one potential answer to the meaningless question, what does a circle sound like? And it sounds like this. <laughs> 